the Deputy Governor of Kano State, who is here represented, the Speaker of the Kano State House of Assembly, the leader of the party, the State Chairman, who doubles as a Prince of the Kano, ancient Kano City, Alaji Abdullahi Abbas, Dan Sarki Jikan Sarki, the only chairman I know, and the only chairman the Kanawas hold on to for big free. Your Excellencies, distinguished senators here are present, including my brother and a friend. I call this one a friend because he's equally, he's exactly a friend. He is precisely a friend because I was with him in the Third Republic National Assembly where he served with me as a member of the House of Representatives. He later went back home and became the executive governor of Ibia State two terms. And he is now back in the Senate, and in the Senate as Chief Whip of the Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Senator Oji Uzokalu. Our own distinguished Senator Barau I. Jibrin. Senator representing Kano North. My respected colleagues, members of the Green Chamber of the House of Representatives who are here present. My dear colleagues, delegates, people of the moment, the delegates who are going to converge on the 30th and the 1st of June on the Eagle Square to decide the future of this country in Nigeria. I salute you and I also appreciate your patience for being patiently here right from 11 o'clock till now to receive our august visitor in the months of May. My distinguished colleagues, members of the House, I would like to introduce to you, even though it's not my jurisdiction to introduce him, that our own is here, the President of the Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, the Chairman of the National Assembly, in a bid to combust for the support of our people to run for the Presidency of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The Sardauna of Body, I would like, because of the exigencies of time, to use this opportunity to welcome you to the Nigeria's largest subnational democracy, Kano State. I welcome you to the most populous state in the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I welcome you to the Kano campus of the Electoral College that will elect the plug bearer for our great party on the 30th and 3rd and 1st of June in Abuja to run for presidency of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I saw, I can see my brother, Senator Oji Uzokalu, looking at me left, right, and center. I want to repeat that you are welcome to the largest subnational democracy in the Federal Republic of Nigeria. This is the Kano campus of the Electoral College that will elect the flag bearer for the presidency of the Federal Republic of Nigeria for our great party you have about 500 members that will converge in Abuja to determine who holds our plug. So as usual, I would like to say, without mincing word, that you have come to a state that will decide who shall or who shall not. Your Excellency, Mr. Senate President, being from Yobe State, the northeastern part of the country, and in Yobe, around the Jigawa Kano border, I want to say that you are welcome home. You are here to interact with your brothers and sisters. And on behalf of every one of us, I wish you very well in the course of your engagement. And I pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to guide our leaders right so that by the 30th of this month and the 1st of June, when we shall all converge in Abuja to decide for our flag bearer, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will guide this party to pick the right candidate who will definitely engage with the opposition, PDP, and any other party to be able to deliver and provide for a smooth transition between Mr. President Muhammad Buhari and the incoming President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria by the decision of our great people of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. 
My dear gentlemen, delegates from this our great state, I also wish you a very fruitful engagement. I wish you a successful interaction with our own Senate President, the President of the Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. May God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria, God bless Kano State, and God bless our leadership right from head to toe. Thank you and God bless everyone. Alhamdulillah.